Hi, my name is Rachel Ewens. I'm a mobile strategist and I run the app blog LadyAppApp.com. And today we're going to talk about how to animate words to drop and bounce using your iPad. So to animate letters to drop and bounce, we're going to use the app Keynote. Keynote's pretty much equivalent to PowerPoint that you might find on a PC. Um, Keynote also has a um, Macintosh desktop version. So to get it to drop and bounce, right now we have a motorcycle. It's right in the middle of the screen. It's just an image we've placed there. Um, it has no animation in it. So if you played the screen, it would just appear. So in order to get it to drop and bounce, we're going to make sure it's selected. So it's got the box around it. And then we're going to go up here in the corner to the wrench. So it's right up here in the upper right, and it's the wrench. And we're going to click the top selection called Transitions and Builds. Now this is going to give us an option how to build it in and how to build it out. So that's basically how it'll appear on the screen and how it'll disappear on the screen. So let's decide how it'll build in. Now there's lots of animation options. You can have it dissolve, you can have it go up in flames, but for the purpose of this one we're actually going to do the drop and bounce. So we're going to choose drop. And there's your motorcycle dropping and bouncing. Now if you want to do the same thing you can have it go drop and bounce on the way out, um, which will also look nice. But that's our basic animation. So now you know how to make text drop and bounce and how to add some other basic animations in Keynote. Again, my name is Rachel Ewens, and this has been how to animate items to drop and bounce on iPad.